Hi, I'm Sarinya. Hi, I'm Pavitra. Hi, I'm Krupa. Hi, I'm Sanchita. Let's look at the first law of thermodynamics. The first law of thermodynamics states that the total energy of an isolated system for which the matter and energy transfer through a system boundary is not possible is constant. The energy can be transformed from one form to another but it cannot be created or destroyed. For this experiment, first we're going to need a plastic bottle, a bucket, a measuring tape, a balloon, a timer, and a kettle. Firstly, prepare the materials needed for the experiment. Secondly, attach the balloon to the mouth of the bottle. Pour 500 ml of hot water in the pail. Meanwhile, Start the timer in phone. Stop the timer once the balloon expanded completely. Measure the balloon's expansion using measuring tape. Remove the balloon from the mouth of the bottle and pour out the water into another pail. Use the newly boiled hot water for the following experiment. Repeat the steps for 1 litre and 1.5 litre of hot water. Experiment, the pail containing hot water acts as surrounding while the balloon and the bottle act as system. When no hot water added, the temperature of the pail and the balloon is the same. Therefore, the balloon is in the deflated state. It is observed that after pouring hot water into the pail, the system which is the balloon and the bottle starts doing work. The balloon which is attached to the mouth of the bottle starts expanding after a certain minute. It is observed that when volume of hot water increases, the size of the balloon is also increases. This is because the more heat is transferred from hot water to the system which is the balloon and the bottle which makes the balloon expand more. Through this experiment, we know that air is really the matter which means it has a weight and take up space. Well, an empty bottle is populated with certain amount of air molecule inside it. The air molecule inside and outside the water, water bottle will move with a constant pressure at a normal surrounding condition. In this activity, we are going to attach a balloon over a bottle's mouth and place into the hot water container. The balloon starts inflating. It is because the air, hot air molecules will enter the balloon from the water bottle which is placed into the hot water container. The hot air molecules will occupy more spaces as they become less denser than usual. When they become less dense than usual, it requires more space to settle down. That's why the balloon starts to inflating and it produces more spaces for the hot air molecules. As a result, we can see the usage of thermodynamics in our daily life such as air pumps, air conditioner, air freezer and heat pump.